hello guys welcome to this new video today we are going to create a logo using Camtasia studio so without wasting any further time let's get started so we'll be creating two logos today uh, one will be with the help of Camtasia studio and the another will be with the help of a website I don't know what's the name of the web website we'll talk about that later so first let's create a logo using Camtasia studio so first I'm on in my main Camtasia studio and I'll make sure my project settings is at 9, 1080p HD and let's go to this annuations bar here and go to this shapes uh, column and select this shape and drag it to the bottom like this so i will delete this group one something i had created before so adjust this shape like this on the center okay and uh, the next thing you want to do is to uh, go here on the properties if you are not enable the properties bar you can enable it by pressing here properties okay then remove the opacity to zero make it completely zero and choose this color to white and uh, give the thickness like um, I guess uh, 60 60 okay 60 is enough I guess okay and make sure you drag this at the center okay we have the out outer shape of our logo so next thing you wanna do is to copy this shape and paste it on the track too like this okay and drag this one at the starting like this and next thing if you want to do is to go to this again properties and change the out outline color make it like i'll choose red okay and change your opacity to i'll change it to like 70 percent 71 i guess this is fine 75 and next thing i want is that i want uh, my shape to represent only half red color so for that to happen we have to press alt and drag this uh, you can see here a box kind of thing and drag this one at the center like this so you, what happened is you can see that we have uh, like a red and a white combination of a hollow circle so I'll make this white as also blue to make this Put, uh, this color this portion to blue I have to go to the track one which I have created I mean the shape which I have created earlier and change the color of that shape I'll change it to blue and I'll set the opacity same as the above one like 76 percent okay we have created the outer portion of our logo then uh, i'll create an inner circle in this uh, here in this portion so i'll add another shape and i'll make sure that the outline opacity is zero and drag this one to the upper like this and the lower and i'll make sure to fit the whole circle okay it's fine right now and the next thing I want to do is to I'll change the solids uh, like inner color to just violet violet would be fine and I'll, I'll reduce the opacity to very low like 40 percent is enough I guess yes 40 percent is enough and I'll drag make sure this fits everywhere yeah and it, uh, this is looking fine so we have created our logo background so pretty much this is the simple logo which i'm creating so you can play with these things and create a logo of your own 
so next thing I want to do is to I will add a text for my logo for to do that go to animation spa and here I, I hope everyone knows that call outs and drag the text to the track for like this and I'll I have like a various fonts I'll give the link of these fonts in the description this is some kind uh, some great fonts so I'll be choosing this one's Avengers Heroic Avenger so I got this font from daftfont.com I guess I'll be putting the links of these fonts okay I'll type the content of uh, the name of my logo okay this is fine and I'll increase the size a little bit as you can see now it's pretty changing and I'll make sure that I'll fit the text in the circle like this As you can see, it is like almost our logo has created. So I'll insert this one a little bit above like this. So if you want, you can create, in, insert any icon you want. So for example, I have here a kind of Caesar thing. So in be below here, you can insert like anything icon and any icon you like so I'm inserting just a random icon here I don't if you want you can insert then uh, otherwise it's fine I'll be just giving a line I did a uh, just a line below that you can make that using this single line so this was a logo our first or first logo so without wasting any further time let's get uh, like how to insert this logo on your videos and stuff so i'll be selecting all these layers all the stuff that i created and i'll be pressing ctrl g what it does it what it does is it creates a group so can you can easily move your logo like and re resize that without having any problems so logo as you can see we have created our logo and uh, i'll show you how to insert or resize this one on your videos so I'll be inserting some, uh, some random intros here. Okay, this is our intro. I'll drag this intro below to the track one. And I'll... as you can see our video is, our intro has started playing and I'll insert my logo here as you can see like this. So you can insert your logo anywhere like on your video. I hope you know all the basics I hope okay then next we'll create an another logo so I'll be creating that with the help of a website so uh, I got this uh, a vector from a website which was available for free the link will be given in the description of this element so this was the background which I have downloaded so it has been already downloaded so another thing if you want a like a vector PNG or a badge backgrounds you can search in Google for like free badge PNG which will be basically your logo without text so you can find more number of uh, like logos without a text so these will be available for free everywhere uh, i'll give these website links in the description so we'll be creating another logo using this this background uh, using this as a background so i'll be inserting this in camtasia studio alter the image file and i'll drag this to the track one so this is a png file it is already transparent so we don't need to remove the background and all so next thing i will do is to i'll go to animations and select some shapes and drag this shape again and i'll resize this shape to the 
inner circle of this background logo background before filling the circle i'll just remove the outline opacity to zero and make its thickness to also to zero and i'll select the shape fill color using this color picker tool and selecting this color of the background circle here and i'll resize the circle make sure everything is right okay as you can see we have erased the text right now behind the we are we have just erased this text so i created a clone of the the circle and i place placed it on above the logo so next thing you want to do is to add your text so i'll be adding a text So I'll be choosing a font which is called as this one. I don't know. Yeah, this font will also be given in the description. I mean, the link will be given in the description. I'll increase the size of the text like this and I'll, and I'll rotate the text and let me place it like this so this uh, is another logo which I have created so it was pretty basic and it was like a basic tips to how to create a logo so you can add anything you like here so you can use your own creativity and create some great logos using this Camtasia so this was a uh, another thing you can res uh, like again select all of these layers and group them by ctrl g and you can see resize it to the bottom and add your video to make sure everything is fine as you can see i'll insert this above like as you can see everything is fine and our logo has been created and it looks really nice so this was a video on how to create a logo using Camtasia studio so it was a basic logo not a professional kind of one so thank you for watching please like the video and hit the subscribe button and the bell icon and make sure you comment on the video